Well, this morning we're having the auditions for the Brunswick Theatre Christmas show, which this year is going to be Hansel and Gretel. The number of roles we're trying to fill today uh, is four. Okay, uh, we have to fill uh, Hansel and Gretel, obviously, uh, and then there is the mother and the father, um, both of which play two roles. So, uh, the father also plays a giant mouse, and the mother plays the old lady. Hi, I'm Joseph C. Walsh, and I'll be directing this year's Christmas show at Brentwood Theatre, um, which is Hansel and Gretel. Uh, this is my first time working here, and I'm really excited to be involved. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, Joe's come to direct us. Um, we held interviews for the director um, this year, and uh, Joe's pitch and personality won us over. <laughs> it was fantastic. It was really good. Uh, really nice to uh, hear the ideas he had, and they just really gelled with what uh, I think we already kind of saw in our heads was happening. Um, and I think he's got some really inventive ideas for use of the space. I think it's going to be fab. Kind of three skills. Each act has to demonstrate three skills. I did well if they make it past the cut, the dreaded cut. Um, but first of all, they have to demonstrate the ability to move well um, and, and ideally dance, uh, which is um, led by our choreographer Sarah. Going through Gangnam Style today, so that should be exciting. Um, and uh, uh, once they've uh, once they've danced a bit and we've assessed how well they move, they then move on to singing. Um, so we then hear each. Auditionally, will sing um, a, a clip from a, a song that they brought with them, um, and maybe if I feel like I need to hear more of them, um, I ask them for a bit of a second song, which is usually a contrasting style. Uh, then after we've seen them move, after we've heard them sing, we then make an initial cut, and then it moves over to Joe's section. Um, and then we'll be seeing them, uh, they'll be delivering kind of one or two minutes of a monologue they've prepared to us. Um, and then after that, we'll break them into groups and see them read, uh, they're called sides, um, from the script, just to see how they cope with each individual character, and most importantly to me, how they work as a team. Uh, where there's only four actors in the show, we really need them to be a very strong unit, a very strong ensemble, have great chemistry with each other, and especially for the two, you know, the father and the mother having to play other roles, um, that sense of versatility uh, in performance, we really need to see that um, and see how they interact as a team. Currently swamped in CVs and just making sure they're all in the right order for everybody. Uh, we see everyone in alphabetical order, normally starting with their, their surname, but sometimes we like to throw in a little bit of a curveball, maybe do it by first or middle name, just to throw them off guard. But um, generally this morning it's going to be everyone in together, so they, I suppose, let their guard down, we get to see their real characters, and that's what we want really from our performers, to have a real character and energy in the room to see that they've got a, a cross-discipline, so they go through drama, um, singing and also dancing, so they're able to do everything that's going to be demanded of them, of the production. And if there isn't something on their CV that maybe they have done, then I'll inquire about it just to make sure that they've got that additional skill. So we've had a, a real big influx of CVs this year, up to around about 80. Uh, we've whittled it down to 30. Obviously some aren't able, able to attend today for whatever reason. We're starting to hit Edinburgh season now, so some people are off uh, treading the boards in Scotland. But we're really pleased with the, the people that have applied. We've got some returners as well, which is lovely to see, because it shows that Brentwood Theatre is really getting a reputation for its Christmas show, and we hope that that will grow.